So, real quick, I've always, I've always been completely honest with you, you know. So, these last 18 months, they've been a little, they've been bullshit, they've been bullshit. But uh, I'll be honest with you. I'm not embarrassed. I, I, I went and started seeing a therapist again during the whole thing. Yeah. I, wouldn't, I wouldn't clap just yet. First session, I called him a cocksucker. And I left the building. And <laughs> Ooh, I told him. I got out to the car, and I immediately started texting him a piece of my fucking mind. And it came out like this. I'm so sorry. I don't know what the fuck got over me? It's been a hard year. Yeah. And he said, hey man, if you want to give me 150 bucks to call me a cocksucker, I'm straight. <laughs> and I was like, that son of a bitch just got me. Yeah. Motherfucker. That's what they're there for. I literally just gave him money. <laughs> so check it out. That way I said, do you mind if I come back next week and just try this shit again? I'm not usually this angry. And he's like, okay. <laughs> No. <laughs> so I came back next week and and he said, hey, hey, something's, something's fucked up. <laughs> what's, what's happened? And I said, what do you mean what's fucking happened? Have you seen the fucking world? And he's like, okay. And he said, he said, what else has happened? And I said, well, my, my father passed away this year. And no, 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 don't need that. He's in heaven fishing right now, catching some huge fucking bass. So I'm sure. But I was like, that fucked me up, man. Like, I'm not the same person as I was. I was in the room with him, you know, and it, it kind of fucked me up. And, and he's like, well, and I, I'm pretty sure that not touring and not seeing these amazing people that have supported you for so many years. He goes, what was it like when you first started touring? And I was like, well, I remember playing the Stone Pony back in like 2001. And I remember... And I remember there being hardly anybody here, and, and, but after the show, after the show, a couple of you came up to me and you said, Hey man, you know that fucking song you played tonight about, well you know, and I said, yeah, and they said, I'm going through that right now. And I said, are you serious? So am I. And it was weird, it was this connection, it wasn't because I was shaking my ass so perfectly, it was because we connected some something, you know? And for once I felt like I was a part of something. And it was nice, right? So the whole point of this is this cocksucker, he said, you've known these people longer than you've known your wife and your kids. And there's this hole that they fill. So when you get back out on the road, make sure you stop the show and you tell them, I love you. It's important. So now I can call that fucking therapist and tell him I did it, right? Okay, let's do this.